What's up guys and welcome back to another Deadman Mode video. This is day 4 of the seasonals. With our cap we dumped it all into mage so we can now use Entangle with 79 magic. Don't have to pot the fire wave. Let's go PKing. Let's try and make some money. If you guys do enjoy, hit that like button, subscribe if you are new and I will see you guys later. I'm putting my long range on. I'm on him. So my friend was fishing at the beach and he actually scouted a guy in full mystics, rune kite shield, like a lot of risk. Basically a max set on seasonal. So I went and tried to go kill him. Yeah, he's missed the gloves, bro. I should be dead here, yeah. Wait, is he not out? Apparently not. Uh, I just had a 28th though, he should die here. Good fight, dude. Full Mystic's the lot, dude. Mystic Robotata, Mystic Robot, he had- oh my god, he had a lot of runes as well, Glory. Let's get that on the pouch as well. Good fight, dude. Holy shit. Black Dead Body. Mystic Gloves. I guess I'll just out the Mystic Gloves because I don't think those are solid. Good fight, dude. So in this clip, a PK error was on my friend who had a G Mall, which at the time was around 800k, and he was getting attacked at Camelot. So we were actually in Team Seek with him, and he told us to go wait in multi, and he's going to go run to us when he's out of food because he was pretty much almost dead to the guy with a G Mall. So we're going to wait in multi and wait for him to come to us, and maybe we'd be able to kill him. He had a G Mall, full Mystic, stuff like that. Like, he had a lot of risk. So we just set up here south of, like, the Ranging Guild near the Temple of Icov entrance, uh, entrance in multi, and uh, waited for him to run to us. I got a freeze. Is that multi? Is that multi? Yeah, it is. Alright. You guys need to let me on if he tanks out, though. Okay, off, off, off. He dropped a good fight, I caught it. I'm with Eco. I don't know who that is, dude. Who's Eco? Yeah. We're just we're still east, dude. Oh, I just stopped bashed him. We're not gonna talk about it. Catch it, nice. Yeah. Did he just lose skull? He did. I have to kill him now. I'm trying seven. He just heart prayed, bro. Is he dead? <gasps> He's actually gonna live. He's actually gonna live. I'm gonna fire wave him out. Three, good fight. Where's the G Mall? So this could potentially be my biggest kill so far. We pick up his G Mall. I go to pick up his runes. And first of all, he had 1.8K Nats just to top it all off. And he had all that other gear as well. So that's close to like just a 1.5 to 2 mil PK just alone. Cause the G Mall was 800K itself could potentially be our biggest kill of the season so far. I don't know, maybe you're just gonna have to keep up watching the video. 1.8k Nats, a G Mall, which is 800k. That's definitely my biggest kill of the season. What do the Bankies hold? A 1 mil key. Okay, 26k, 5k, a 1 mil key. 400, 156k cash, a Leaf Bladed Sword, 1k Broad Bolts, 133 Sharks. Nine brews. This skews it a little bit, but that is such a nice key. And that was my biggest kill. That's over like a 2 mil PK in total because the G Mall itself sells for 800k. Good fight. Holy shit. So it's like the Cathabee Dogs, and this guy was fishing in a granite shield and a root full home. And I think granite shield was about 80k at the time because only people were just starting to get defense. Like for the first couple days, everyone's 40 defense and everyone was just getting like 50 to 60. So the granite shield was actually worth quite a bit. And I thought he would just tank me because I had no KO potential. I only had range and mage and he had to run like, I don't know, three freezes or some shit if I got lucky. So I just got on him. I didn't expect to kill him. His name was like a meatball or something. And he was a pretty low level, but he did have a granite shield. They killed this guy. Dude, this guy might actually die. I think he's gonna die. He actually died. What the fuck? I just got a granite shield PK. What the hell? Dude, I was I was just I was just like hitting this guy. I thought he'd make it into the bank, but I guess he didn't have enough food because I just got a granite shield, his bank key, rune full helm. Like that's actually a really decent kill. 
Good fight, dude. Let's get that bank key so we don't lose it. We're a dead body. Good fight, dude. Damn. Oh, did, did he got me? No, he didn't got me. Alright. Let's put a bolt in. Nice. What is that? Is he even gonna fight me back? He's got a rune crossbow and red dehyde. And he's just like chilling at camel. He's got black robes or priest robes or whatever. What even are those? He's smited there. Let's put a bolt in. Nice. 25. I'm gonna need to refreeze him soon, I'm pretty sure. Go for a refreeze in a second. Who's that? Okay, he's refrozen. Nice. Rag Summers. What a name. 24 bolts. He's still praying mage. He's just sitting in his robes. He's gonna get hit so hard. Let's go for another bolt. Nine. Let's go for another one. Just drink a prayer pot here. Go for a fire wave. Need to refreeze him in a second. I don't know where his escape is. He might have agility and I don't have agility. Uh, I mean the Seer's agility course or whatever. Let's fire wave him. Oh, I just fired away the wrong guy. That's super awkward. We're not going to talk about it. That guy might hit me back now. 30? Jesus. Let's entangle him here. Splashed. He might have agility. I don't know. Okay, nice. I caught it. He's just sitting in his robes. I don't know why he's tanking his robes. I don't get it. 7? Like, he has dehyde. That would just be better. I don't get it. The Tome of Fire is now empty. Put a bolt in. 0. Fuck. He might have agility. Does he? He doesn't even have agility, bro. Like, where is he running to? I don't get it. Put a bolt in. Another zero. I'm out of Tome of Fire charges right now, so I just have to keep bolting him. It's slightly frustrating. I'm hitting zeros as well. He might have this little escape here. At, um, what's it called? Let's close this large door. Nice. Entangle him. Nice, we caught it. Okay, he should die here. He's out. Except I'm hitting all zeros. It's fakey mage here. Maybe I'll change his prayers. Another zero. Are you serious, dude? There we go. He should die here. Good fight. I had no Tome of Fire charges left. That would have been awkward, huh? Rune Square Shield. Five keys now as well. I'll take it. Okay, well, I didn't really have space to loot all of that. Because my Tome of Fire is um out of pages. I can't even out the stuff. But I got the rune cross with the rune square shield, the red dehyde, and the mystic gloves and shit. Should stop for a decent bit, and we also have five keys now, which we do need to wait out. Good fight, dude. Alright, five keys. I don't think any of them are going to be good, but we can check. 69 mil! Oh, it's the two broad arrowheads. Oh, 50 sharks to be fair. That's an okay key. 25 case of broad sharks. 7.3k cash. Yeah, they're all pretty terrible, but 69 mil. Not bad. This guy's name's literally Port Vavor, man. Let's catch a freeze, or we can just splash. He's got black dehyde as well. We're gonna have to take him out if we can. Let's put a bolt in. He's got decent prayers. By that I mean he switched once. Oh, actually he switched twice now. I think he might get the prayer range on there. Oh, he's still praying mage. Interesting. He's going for a bolt. Decent. Let's fake you there. One bolt before he's unfrozen. And you get the refreeze. I just misclicked stun or some shit, and now we're splashing. Catch it. There we go. Nice. Let's check out the smite here. Going. Refreeze him. Did he got me? I think he might have. He can tally now if he wants to. Okay, we caught it. Nice. Maybe he doesn't have the tally. I don't know. Let's check out the smite. He's going for a fire wave. He's getting like every prayer, right? He's going for bolts. Oh, apart from that one. He's going for another bolt. Oh, he's changed priority again. 26. Then get one more bolt, then we need to refreeze him. Is he out of run? Refreeze him. Nice. Probably going to get the prey mage on there. Nice. Bolts. He's going for a mage now. Fake him out. Go back in for the mage. Is he dead here? He's dead. Good fight. Black D head, which is still like 30k a set, so that's worth it. In my opinion. Rune crossbow. Broad bolts on the top. How many? 300. That's definitely worth it. Then rune crossbow as well. Let's just drop the ranger pot. Black D head body. Black D head chaps. That was a really good kill. Good fight, dude. He had wrath runes. Did I see those? Oh no. I'm just going blind, but that was still a good kill. Good fight. Alright. One key off this guy with black D head and a rune crossbow. 11 sharks. Eh, the stuff will sell for like 60k plus anyway, so it's fine. Let's bolt this guy, nice. Hey, did her? Hey, bro, you've got a rune full helm that I really, really want. Love the vids, thank you very much. Let's put a bolt in. He's got red dehyde, blue dehyde, but he has a rune full helm. I don't get it. He's not even fighting me back. Oh, there he is. 30. Nice. He's playing melee himself, so I think I'm just gonna fire wave him right here. Nice. Let's go for one more fire wave. Oh no, we should have caught the freeze there. These scorpions are gonna I mean the skeletons are gonna cause a trouble. Actually, we might be able to avoid them if we just go west now and he hits me back. Oh, this uh, skeleton might hit me actually. 
This could be difficult. He didn't telly right away, to be fair, so maybe he doesn't have a telly. Because a lot of these people feel pretty safe because they're right next to, um, what's it called? Oh, yep. Put a bolt in. I could die, potentially, if I don't eat, so might want to eat just to stay safe. Scorpion. Don't do it. Freeze him. Nice. Okay, we froze him. Put a bolt in. Decent. Let's just hop after that bolt. Let's bolt him again. Nice. Let's keep going. Is he out of food? He might die here then. Let's keep bolting him. He didn't change his prayers. Good fight, dude. And we got his rune full home and stuff. That's really good loot. Rune full home. Rune crossbow. That's decent loot. Good fight, man. Let's pick that all up and get it in the bank because we have immunity, obviously. 49k key. Pretty terrible. Friends are on some PK or I don't even know where this is, like south of Camelot in some like quest location. I don't know where the hell this is. Anyway, like MSB, Black D had Power Ami, Mystic Cat, stuff like that. He almost DDS'd me out to be honest, but I did eat in the same hit. He DDS'd me and I had PID, so I wouldn't have died. Hit him with the 24. Guess he was a viewer. Good fight to you, man. Sorry, you know, I had to kill you, but it is the name of the game. DDS, stuff like that. Black D had probably like 80k and just the loot, and then we have his key. He's got some red D had and a rune crossbow. And I'm splashing. Okay, we caught it. Nice. Does he not have any prayer left? Looks like he's been taking a beating from the dragons. We just surged a 30 into him. I mean, waved. 21. Sure, just auto cost us. He's not even changed his prayers. <laughs> Good fight. I've just three hit the guy because you don't change your prayers. And fire wave, you know, if you get the right RNG, it's just too strong. He even had bruise and stuff on him. Rune crossbow. I'm a little power. Let's just out the red dehyde and shit. That might be a good key. Either way, the rune crossbow and stuff, it's good loot. So good fight, dude. Alright, so this is another really weird fight against another PK. He was a level 79 with the weirdest build I've ever seen. He was in blue dehyde with a rune crossbow. He had a DDS, and he also had mage. And for his mage gear, he had the good old salad robes, the green robes. I haven't seen those in quite some time. Haven't been on 07 in quite a bit. There you can see he throws them out. He had flames of Zami as well. So a pretty interesting build. And we just started fighting it out near the Cathby Bank, you know, trying our best not to run in the safe zone, because that would be pretty bad. And eventually we do kill him and get his loot. And of course, you know, it's some decent loot, DDS, Rune Kite Shield, stuff like that, Rune Crossbow, and we get his key as well. Good fight, dude. Keys, let's see what we got out of them. Open the Deadman chest, and 140k, that 558 mil is going to be broad hour tips. That's all the prices are just got for us. 17k cash, some sharks, some restores, that's actually decent. 115k, some sharks again, a brew, some seeds, that's good. 558 mil, you have the broad arrowheads, the coal, the iron ore, attack and strength pots, I guess, 11k, oh well. Go for a fire wave here in a second. I don't think he has the agility shortcut, so I wonder where he's gonna go. Let's catch a freeze there, nice. Let's put a bolt in. He probably has like full invent of food, he's literally just a bolt ragger. Let's go for another fire wave, zero. Go for a bolt there, decent. Oh, that's actually a big hit. Pre range here. He hasn't changed his prayers. He's still just praying mage, so I guess I'll keep bolting him. Where's he running to? I don't know. I don't think he has melee in it either. Nice, we caught. He's praying mage right now. Honestly, his mage has to be so low for me to hit like constant 16s through prayer. I think I have a glitch spot here. Yeah, I do. Go for a fire wave. Nice. I think I can get one more than I need to refreeze him. Yeah, let's refreeze him here. Nice, there we go. We got it right away. He barely got any steps. Keep going around the tree. Go for a fire wave here, nice. I think I've got him in another glitch spot. Maybe? Yep. Oh no, we don't. I lied. I'm a big fat liar. Let's go for a fire wave in a second. Is he smited? Is he completely out of prayer? You know, entangle him. Where's he gonna run? I don't know. Entangle him? He's running south? I'm still splashing. Like, how many times am I gonna splash? There we go, nice. Okay, let's go around a tree again. I think he's out of prayer completely. So I'm just gonna fire wave him. Because I think that's best DPS on this guy. Does he have no overheads? Let's just use our bruise here. Get a little bit higher HP. Going for a fire wave again. Bro, this guy's almost like lured me into the bank somehow. Like, he just keeps running and running and running. Okay, there we go. Nice. He must have so much food. There's another 28. Decent. Use the tree again. Nice. He has to be out of food soon. Legit. Come on. Six. Is he just gonna suicide into the bank? I think he's dead. Good fight, dude. He, he has so much food. Legit. Alright, let's pick that all up and get out of here. Good fight, man. Rune kite shield, rune full helm, and rune bolt. See, yeah, he's just literally just a bolt ragger. We managed to get the hill combat bracelet as well. Alright, let's check this key off this PK. We gave us some very decent loot. Open the diamond chest. 149k, some dragon bones, some sharks, prayer pots, 
range pots. Not that much, but I'll take it off of PK. Plus, his loot was really good. I'm going to go sell that all now. So I was in the Slayer Cave, and I saw this guy killing Basilis or whatever. He looked like a complete bolt ragger, so it was probably a very stupid idea to attack him. He even had recoils, which I saw right away. So if I did get on him, he already already automatically has 40 damage on me, and that can get a little frustrating. I was scared he would outlast me, but eventually, you know, he did manage to run. I don't know if he had a lot of food anyway, so I just started chasing him down. I think he should die here. Put a bolt in. He's out, I think. Is he? Oh no, he still has food, Jesus Christ. Let's re-entangle him here. Oh, he's dead, good fight. Finally got him, bro. He was working us, he was just rag ranging, killing us. Let's pick that all up. Good fight, dude, got his key, he had some coins. He had, even had mithril seeds, bro. He's a pro he had dragonstone bolts. This guy is a proper ragger, dude. Legit, he's a proper just bolt ragger. 1k broad bolts, black dehyde, 61 gnats. Don't mind if I do, I'm gonna pick that all up. And the snakeskin boots are like some of like 40k each or some shit, so. I'm going to pick that up too. Good fight, dude. All right, two keys. That second kill was really big. Open dead man chest. Uh, I guess, you know, he's making money through that, I guess, where he was risking all his stuff. 91k and a 10k key. Kills are still really big, though. So earlier on in this video, you saw potentially what could have been my biggest kill of the season with those 2k nats, the gmol, etc. Right here, me and my friends are peeking at the Slayer Cave, and we found this guy with a fire cape. He had a dragon plate skirt, which was like around a mil at the time. He had piety quested, like he had a lot of stuff. He had full mystic switch as well for snares. Like he was risking a shit ton. He had, I don't know, I don't even know how much he was risking. We got on him outside and he was actually TB'd at this time because we had one friend with TB's. So he pretty much had no escape. He did have mystic so he could try and snare and telly. But I had a lot higher mage level, which means I had a lot higher mage defense. And I also had entangle, so I had a 15 second freeze to his 10 second. So it was going to be really difficult for him to do it without, you know, me having him frozen at the same time. And this is when he runs away and starts to panic. I'm on him in. I just bolted him. He's running in. I got a freeze. Don't worry. Don't worry. I got him in a glitch spot, I think. He should die here. Don't worry, dude. I'll re-entangle him. Relax, bro. I have entangled his snares. Dude, he's dead. Good fight. So potentially our newest biggest kill. I don't know. Dragon plate skirt right at the top of the pile. Nature runes at the top, just there. Mystic robe top. Dragon scimitar. There was just so much loot. I couldn't even fit all in my inventory. This guy didn't have 2k knots. He had 500. Then he also had a big cash stack. He had a DDS stuff like that. I'm Lord of Glory. Did split some of it with my friend who TB'd, but apart from that, that was also close to 1 to 1.5 mil PK just in, like, stuff. And then, of course, we had the key that we had to pick up. All right, four keys. That last one's probably the biggest key so far, or the biggest kill so far. One mil key, I think that's off him. 86k, pretty bad. 26k, 9k cash in that. 10k, another one mil key. 309k cash, 141 dragon bones, 11 prayer pots, 36 sharks. Holy shit, that's a big kill. The D skirt alone is like 700k. I think I'll save that for when I get 80 death, but right now we have a 2 mil cash stack and loads of loot in our bank. If we weren't PKing with our friends, probably wouldn't have got any of this. So it's probably a smart idea that for this season I decided to PK with some friends. Good fight. Alright guys, that's going to be it for today's video. Two very big PKs. Killed a lot of PKers, you know. I think those two big, uh, those two PKs are some of the biggest of the season so far from any PK. PKer. So if you guys have enjoyed that, you know, hit that like button, subscribe if you are new. I think we're like 200 off 25,000 subscribers. So if you guys could help me get there, it'd be greatly appreciated. Anyway, I'll see you guys later and I hope you did enjoy.